I just recently finished listening to the audio book, The Law of Attraction, How to Get More of What You Want and Less of What You Don't Want. I believe the author's name is Michael Lausier. It's not the first book I ever read on the topic. However, it did inspire me to create some more insights into this matter. The Law of Attraction simply is this law where you get what you want in, instead of what you don't want, or you try to at least, like the title of the book suggests. As Wayne Dyer put it, the Law of Attraction means you get what you are, not what you desire, necessarily. Though if you get it right, you can get the two. Another way to put it is the Law of Attraction is you're getting this energy that you're putting out. A lot of people go after things they don't want, as the Law of Attraction writers and speakers say, and thus their whole aim is to get people focused on what they want. I think the prime example of a bad way is Westboro Baptist Church. Not just them, but their opponents. Because both exemplify this. The Law of Attraction, as these people state, is something you want to harvest, I'm sorry, harness to your best of ability and thus if you are getting what you don't want then there's a problem. Now in the audiobook by Michael Lousier, I believe the author's name, The Law of Attraction, he has a clarity section and a contrast section. He says a contrast is a good thing because it shows you what you don't need. He says you don't want to dwell on it but you do need it there. And Westboro Baptist Church is a perfect example. They dwell on what they don't want. He, the author of the book, encourages people to have positive ways of reflecting of what they want rather than saying, I don't want this. You need to think, I want this. Westboro Baptist Church doesn't do that. But also, on the other hand, the opponents don't do that. Wise observers and commentators do know that one of the best things you can do at Westboro Baptist Church is ignore them. But of course, few are that wise or have the ability to resist this. For example, in the funeral picketing case, one observer noted, by banning their right to picket, we have made them more willing to continue this up. The observer noted, the best thing we could have done was to ignore them. Indeed, indeed. The law of attraction demands that we ignore things like Westboro Baptist Church that we don't want. We don't want to be like them. They don't ignore what they don't want. They keep getting the negative energy because that's what they're focused on.